here's another Mancer coming at ya. Who doesn't love the rodeo? And no event is more dangerous than bull riding. Bull riders suffer more injuries than anyone else in rodeo. But there's one non-competition event so brutal, even professional bull riders like Ryan Brown won't take part in it. Shark fishing is what I'd compare it to, I think. You be in the bait. Carnage. <laughs> What rodeo event is more dangerous than bull riding? It's called cowboy poker. Basic rules for cowboy poker would be sit in a little plastic chair in the middle of the arena. Try to stay in that chair as long as you can while there's a 2,000 pound bull run circles around you. Stay in your seat the longest and you win. Las Cruces, New Mexico, 2002. This was supposed to be just a fun sideshow, but it became the most dangerous cowboy poker game ever. A.D. Stromberg is sitting at the poker table with four other players, and one's a woman. The bull charges. Three players all ask to safety, but Stromberg is sent flying. The bull mauls him on the ground, goring him with its horns as he tries to hold it back from attacking the woman next to him. The rodeo clowns rush in to save his ass, and one of them gets it in the ass. The clown saves Stromberg's life, but his ear is hanging off the side of his head, along with a chunk of his scalp. It'll take 240 stitches to reattach them. Look closely, and you can see the grisly damage. Turns out, the bull they used that day was a Mexican fighting bull, far more ferocious than the average rodeo bull. And for taking on that rampaging monster, A.D. Stromberg took home the grand prize, 200 bucks. But he knows he's lucky to be alive. What rodeo event is more dangerous than bull riding? Cowboy poker. 